they go. That won't come back to bite us later, I hope. They cannot be underestimated. Their power isn't enough to defeat me, but I lack the means to overpower them myself. Well, yes. Your regeneration sacrament alone isn't enough to beat them. It only ensures your survival. So then, how do we deal with them? I've got an idea. Zest? I was watching Georg, saw you fight, and you know what? You really are stronger. And thanks to you, I'm over it. I think I'll take your advice. What's that supposed to mean? What? Why would you want Galahorn? Are you really that surprised, tough guy? I'm still the number one candidate for inheriting Deus, right? Quite. Yes, that is true. You are number one. Georg is two. Damn it, Joachim. See? So really, doesn't that put me higher up on the list for ownership of the sword? Damn you, Zest. We had a deal. I agreed I would fight you after I received the power of Deus. You said you would help me with the resurrection first. Sorry, but I don't really care about any promises anymore. Back then, I was so desperate to fight a real challenge, I figured a god would do the trick. So I took your deal. But now, now I have someone I have to fight. I have to get stronger than them. So I just gotta use anything I can to make that happen. Deus, or the world dragons, I'll take whatever I can get. Why now? Why are you doing this? Push forward, no matter the consequences. That's what you said, right? Well, I'm ready to do anything to get stronger. Marvelous. In that case, allow me to readjust Galahorn for you, Zest. <laughs> Joachim, man, come on! Aren't you listening? Zest? What? Uh... You heard the man? Damn the consequences! We can do a whole lot more than that. Now you're gonna get to have some real fun. <laughs> Time to show the world what you can do. We're gonna make a masterpiece! <laughs> How do we even fight Georg? How do we beat someone who can heal all his wounds the moment he gets them? Maybe if we hit him so hard that he wouldn't have time to recover. But I don't even know how we'd do that. True. He survived a head-on assault from the Draco Machina. Could we surpass that power? Could we even match it? Maybe the Shining Dragon could do it. Wait, really? I don't know for sure, but if I could use the Shining Dragon's full power, then... maybe. Why yes, we've never seen its full strength after all. But are you gonna be okay? You know what happens when you... I agree. If you push yourself too hard and lose control again... It's okay. I know. I won't push myself that far. Even if the power overwhelms me again, I'll be fine as long as you're all with me. I guess so. We stuck together before, and we still got through it. All right. We're going to fight back, together. If Georg wants to resurrect Deus, he'll have to go through us. Yuma. Yuma.
What's wrong? You mentioned unleashing our power, completely breaking my seal. Yeah, we might have to if we want to beat Gyori. You cannot! Huh? That limit is not for you to break. Why not? This is the first time you've ever told me not to use your power. Indeed. If you desire the power to fight, I offer it freely. That shall not change. I ask only one condition. Do not reach beyond our limits. Do not call upon all of my strength. Then tell me why. Yuma, there remains one secret I have kept from you. Gina spoke true. I should have told you much sooner. I could not bring myself to see it. But the time has come. I must speak plain with you. If... Huh? What are you talking about? If you unleash my true ultimate power, it will destroy you in body and soul. <laughs> Do you see now? No matter the reason, you must never wield my full power. <sighs> Sorry, but I can't promise that. What? If that's the only option I have, then I won't hesitate. Yuma. Now I have the energies of all five world dragons. Even if something goes awry, I should be prepared for the worst. Even if the seal's weakened more than my estimates, even if it breaks, I can seal it again. But with no dragon soul at its core, I can only unleash the energy a single time. I'll have to be careful about when I use it. How will the seven dragoneers move? And will I finally see the path to the last song? Now is the time to observe. The key to everything lies within Yuma. But the most unpredictable element now is the Sanguine Church itself. Georg, with his newfound power, and that boy who claimed himself the strongest, Zest. He could be a threat. Not many moves left until the game is over. I need to think carefully.